And with that, Baron Corbin is on the loose. And you get the feeling that they'll be talking about this match on the beautiful beaches of San Diego tomorrow. Gets him with a kick. Oh, here it comes! No, oh, that might have just shattered their face. And that might be just Two. enough to win. I don't know if Corbin can recover. I hate to agree with you, but you're right. He's trying again. Well, win a singles match. Here is your winner, Philip Russell. Big win for him here tonight. The multi-time champion, the franchise of WCW Sting. Just look into the singer's eyes and not much more needs to be said. The former powerlifting and NCAA football standout Big E has come a long way in sports entertainment. Really, Saxton? I wouldn't consider wearing a unicorn horn on my head and pouring sugary cereal in the mouths of strangers as making an indelible mark in the annals of WWE. Just implying such a thing is absurd. Maybe you should try it. In the Man. face! Look at this. Oh no, clogging the airflow. He's just about there. Whoa, he, he works his way out. I think this one's over. And Big E makes the cover. One, two, he gets his shoulder up before three. He showed up here tonight for a fight, and that's exactly what we are seeing. Back in from the floor. Oh, foot just stomping down. There he goes, crashing to the floor. He get dangerous. Big E looking for the pin. One, two, and another three. kick out. Yeah, seemed to be just testing the waters a bit there. Has his opponent up. This is about to be over because here comes. Has his opponent up. This is about to be over because here comes. Of the neck. Oof. He's stuck in the corner now. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Just sending a message there. Big E making a statement as we speak. What does Sting have to do at this point to stay in this match? He's not looking great, but never count him out. The black and white. This could be it. Cover. And a fast kick out from Sting. Sting has seen way too much in his storied career to be taken out by that. The powerhouse of the New Day has his opponent up. The big ending. Can he score the pin? up the win. Here is your winner, Big E! The referee's three count ends this one. And there's your winner, folks. And there you have it. Another rocking victory. One of the most captivating in-ring talents. This could be big. 
devastating. Cedric Alexander is in a real bad spot. Oh, looks like we're gonna see it. That hit the spot. He's finished. Yeah, there's no coming back from that. This singles contest has a victor. Here is your winner, Ethan Luther. A very decisive victory here tonight. The Queen City's favorite son. Tonight we bear witness to one of the most dominant competitors in WWE history, the ultimate warrior. Sounds to me like Anaheim is ready to get this one going, and so are we. with that one. Oh man, Warrior is in trouble now. Hey, I guess you never know. Big opportunity for him now. Oh man, Ultimate Warrior doesn't even know where he is. They tapped out. It's all over. Here is your winner, Damien Peltier. That's a big win right there. All right, it's time to kick this thing off. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are gonna have a match you'll wanna watch over and over again. Interesting move here, taking the match to the outside. If you're just joining us, welcome to Monday Night Raw. I'm Michael Cole alongside Corey Graves and Byron Saxton. Looking stunned. Looking rocked. Ouch. Punch right to the face. Down to the floor. Back in from the floor. Looks like he has other plans here. I think he was just looking to soften him up a little here. There he goes, crashing to the floor. Meteora. Boom! <laughs> Pow! What a shot. Simply said, this is going to be a great match. This is Monday Night Raw, the show that put WWE on the map. Bang right in the face. Haymaker connects. Oh, man, what a strike. 
Oh, as we tear the features clean off your face. This is just going to be physical. There's no other way to describe it. Uh-oh, we know what's next. just reeling from that offense. He's getting beaten up out there, but staying from out of nowhere. RKO! And shoulders are down. Two count. This singles match has come to an end. Wow. Here is your winner, Cliff Punk. A big singles victory here tonight. If you didn't believe this guy before, there's no reason not to now. Not after that performance. The bruiser weight peaked on. Oh, Harry Davari looks to finish the. John has him where he wants him. This could be it. Incoming. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no countouts. Bringing it back into the ring. Oh, what a kick! Once more, setting it up! Good golly, what a knee! Close quarters, oh, what a <laughs> knee! Trying to go for it again! Larry! And that can be all. Let's see. Oh, man. Dunn is in trouble now. Is it enough? The bruiserweight Pete Dunn still has some fight left, which means trouble for his opponent. Now, look at his aggression. Just pure brutality. Come on, easy. Producing a trampoline. Watch out. Buddy Bulldog. Devari showing the heart of a Persian lion. Just an onrush of offense here. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. So mean, so nasty. That describes the bruiser weight, Pete Dunn, to a T. And he's so young that it's scary how much of a naturally vindictive streak he has. And Devari makes the cover. Gonna take more than that. A ah, slap. You're watching Monday Night Raw. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the longest running weekly episodic television show in history. Another chapter of Monday Night Raw. What's Ooh. next? Oh my God, what an arm breaker. Oh man, what a strike. This match's brutality starting to show on him. A change of strategy has to be his next move. Picture perfect drop kick. Now look at his aggression, just oh, pure brutality. Come on, easy. in from the floor. Ooh, that kick. Yikes. 
Sucks. That'll either wake you up or knock you out. Ooh, that hurt. What a sharp one right to the cheekbone. It's going to be interesting who comes up on top early on in this contest. He's looking to bring this one to the outside where things can get ugly in it. Dunn looking to end this thing. Has it set up. Bitter end. This could be the chance he was looking for. Moves like that have a way of reverberating throughout the entire body. He's done with the victory. Big win for the Bruiser Wait. Here is your winner, the Bruiser Wait. Pete Dunn. That's a win. Nikki Bella, of course, the powerhouse of the Bella Twins can... Oh, here we go. What a sidewalk slam. She just created a prime opportunity. How is Nikki Bella going to remain alive? Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. She wants it one more time. What a way to win a singles match. Here is your winner, Eli Anna Caldwell. Huge victory here in one-on-one -on -one action. Drew McIntyre has been waiting for this moment all day. Every match is another chance for him to unleash a brutal display of power and aggression. Making other people hurt is what he loves most. And we're coming to you from Sin City. Have you ever seen those movies where the guys steal a baby and have misadventures in Vegas? Yeah. Yeah, that's actually based on Mung Ai's life story. We almost did it again last night. We just missed the tiger. He's not giving up that easy. Oh, ouch. Bringing it back into the ring. There he goes, crashing to the floor. They get dangerous out here, especially when there are no count outs. If you're just joining us, welcome to Monday Night Raw. I'm Michael Cole alongside Corey Graves and Byron Saxton. Top Bay God Hero! If that's not it, I don't know what is. But now, can Drew McIntyre capitalize? Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. Still seems a little early. I don't think I've seen a superstar more driven to succeed than Drew McIntyre. When he was released in 2014, McIntyre said he'd be back, and that's exactly what happened. Oh, McIntyre really took a negative and turned it into a positive. Instead of feeling sorry for himself and blaming everybody else, he traveled the globe and made himself an even bigger star. In the face! Well, that'll hinder your modeling career. Drew McIntyre fans with some reason to worry here. Taking on some offense, but he expected as much. Following up on what you two were saying about McIntyre's initial release, not only did he return with more fire and fans, he also came back in even better shape than before. And yeah, McIntyre's always had a height advantage, but in his time away, he worked on his strength, conditioning, and added considerable power to his Claymore kick. An aftershock DDT. That's one way to retaliate. Whatever works. Kick right to the midsection. Point of the elbow, nailed it. Oh, jeez. There's no way he's getting up from that. Here is your winner, 
And that's a huge win for this guy.